Duncan. So, oh, right, we're going to put Laura down. That's a great shot there from Lee Wood. Clean up the corner, the chin of Laura. Sitting there just waiting for it. Championship belt this evening after the failing at the weighing of Mauricio Lara, but still so much tension in the air here. Him stabbing that jab into the body, walking on to a left. He needs to keep this concentration on Leeward. He's proven that already. Steps in with a lead hand. Lara, he held his feet far too often, and that allowed Lara to land big body shot, big left hook from Lara, but a push puts Lara down. Waiting for that opportunity as Wood gets to work behind the left jab. And it has to remain switched on. Oh, right up a couple of by left hook, good work by Lee Wood. Good body shot, Lee Wood. Very close, close, close cut, right up, wasn't he? I mean, the blueprint's there from the first fight for Lee Wood, though he couldn't say, so, oh, right up a couple, puts Lara down. That's a great shot there from Lee Wood. Clean up the cut on the chin of Lara, sitting there just waiting for it. Chris Bright and Neil Landed from Lee Wood is looking for that. Lara onto the ropes and fires a lovely right hand over the left. Beautiful shot from Lee Wood. No question, Lara shaken by that once again. Back to orthodox. Nice left hook as Lara lets his hands go. From the southpaw stance. Another brilliant right hand from Wood. I'll tell you what, these right hands on the landing, they're having the effect. Definitely hurt to the body in the first fight, Lara, but... Yeah, just loading up a little bit, wasn't it? Oh, that sits down on the power, sends him in body and head. That was one of the adjustments that was needed from the first fight, dropping the right hand. Small adjustments needed, and they make a big difference at elite level. Not to switch on. Always looks to end the argument, Lara, with that left hook. Just looks to throw and exchange with Wood. Whoever finishes strong here now wins the round. Wood. Back in Lara onto the ropes. He just smiles. Walks onto a jab from Wood. Good boxing, good footwork. Dangerous combination he throws Lara. That right hand to the body, big wide right hook, and then he follows it up upstairs. He missed on two occasions in this round, but it does look a dangerous combination. You can get a bit closer and land that left hook. And when there's nothing happening, it's important that he lets that jab go. Wood took a left hook on the right glove. Yeah, little adjustments, small adjustments, as they've said. And they feet very, very good. Look at the left hook again, Lara. And the right hand, using the feet really well, Wood. A lovely short right hand there from Lee Ward when he lands it, just on the forehead. If somebody wants to dominate, they need to, they need to get behind the jab. And I think Lee Ward's got the opportunity to do that with his height and reach, in control of this fight. Who does the pace favour, do you think, Cole? Well, you do wonder if, if Lara's struggling, if he's feeling it in there, and he, he don't really want to press the pace just because of the way... to land the body shots again, moving out of range. He just has to stay switched on. You see the right hand there, he's looking to get over the, the left jab of Lee Wood. Lara with that right hand now. Nothing in between. That's a good jab by Lara. And Lara's been pushing the pace pretty much only in the last 10 or 15 seconds of each round. Oh, so right up again. Good stuff from Wood, controlling the distance well, holding the centre of the ring. Got to stay switched on, good right hand. You see Lara looking for that left hook. Just keep doing what you're doing until we have to change it. Yeah, win by any means necessary. Has to turn the screw, has to roll the dice. Good shot, lovely right uppercut, followed by the left hook by Lee Wood. Don't trade with a dangerous puncher. You know he can turn your lights off at any moment. Good work to the body from Lara. And heading into the territory where the finishing punch landed from Lara first time around. And he's, he's nicking these rounds. You know, you've seen it time time again. I'm not saying he's not doing anything, because he is. I mean, if Lee Wood switches off, there'll be a shot there for him, but this is not going to be good enough from Lara. You're defending your titles. You're getting picked off. Walks in with a left hook there, though. Oh, 
right hand there, slightly off balance, Lee Wood. For me, it's, it's just not acceptable. We're in the championship round and we need to see a little bit more urgency. If you're behind, you have to press home the advantage and go to work. And Lara just took another crisp, clean right hand off Lee Wood. So you can walk him onto that right hand again. His corner team should, should know quite well that they're losing by a, by a big margin and they've got to press this, this fight home and, and do something. He's just picking shots. And get something going. You see me now on his toes, jab in, comes forward, just lands a shot there. That's a good shot, Ali Wood, nice little clean right hand. I feel like Lara looks, he looks unsteady on the feet. I was about to say it a minute ago, he looks a bit... Like he's irky jerky on his feet and he's not quite got his balance and he's just so easily sort of shook to the floor there. You can feel how strong they are, what they've got, and when they're holding or if they're leaning on you or if they're kind of wilting away. And I think Lee would have been thinking to himself, you know what? I think I'm in control here and I've got nothing to worry about. Woods pulling ever further clear. But if there's nothing coming back at him and he's winning these rounds, then why not? Every now and again, you get an easy day at the office, but you wouldn't expect it to be for a world title. Just outworking him, throwing 360 there to Lara's 273. I mean, and landed 35% of them. Lara's throwing far less punches, having far less success, and that's what we're looking at. And this has shown that you know what? He's come back in here. He can win a world title, nice and steady. Use your feet, and that's exactly what he's done, Lee Wood, throughout this contest. Lovely right hand again. He walked onto that one, Lara. Be interesting to see how Lara responds now. He's tried to produce something in the closing seconds of most of the previous rounds. Of what has been a calculated, technically brilliant performance from Lee Wood. Left hook lands from Lara in the early stages of the round. Which we saw in that first fight. Nice, crisp, sharp right hand from Lee Wood there. Lovely left hook from Lee Wood. Heading towards the final minute of the final round. 30 seconds away from, from retaining or getting back, grabbing back that world title belt that he lost so devastatingly in the first one. This has just been simply a clinical performance from Lee Wood. He came here as the second favourite. Many feared he would face the same ending as last time around, but he's produced a technically flawless performance. The performance of his career to mention the psychological hurdle he's had to overcome.